when I see the fans, it really means something to me. You know, I, I had a fan this morning that was outside from six o'clock in the morning waiting for me to go into the morning show and she drove from like nine o'clock last night. Stuff like that is heartwarming. I, I think that's because I'm real. I think that's because what you see is what you get. And no matter how big or how much money or whatever, I never forgot who I am, where I came from. That's who I am. I'll always be that person. So my dad has all these delicious recipes, but if I can make them look like these cakes, it's a recipe for success. I read, I, I, I surfed the internet. I would call up the flower companies and try to understand why to use different flowers, um, you know, what's the protein content have to do with it. So it was almost like an obsession to, to become the best. And I did that. Hey guys, I had a great time meeting you with Paul. We're looking for TLC's next great presenter. And honestly, when I started Cake Boss, I started because I wanted to grow my business. I wanted to make my bakery household name. I didn't realize how it was going to impact so many people. And it has. I see little kids like, you know, want to become bakers because of me. You know, I had a little girl tell me that she's so inspired that she believes she can do anything because I do. You know, so when you hear these different things, and it means so many different things to so many different people, well, it's not about that anymore. It's about how can I create more content that's going to be inspiring, that's going to be family friendly, that's going to um, be awesome. So my commitment is to help be that partner where we can help with ad sales, where we can help with... Um, affiliates where we can help with making content um, or just coming here and making a big deal uh, for the fans so they get more engaged and they start to see what it is because again you know it's a partnership so uh, I couldn't be more happy and excited to be here <laughs>